What's up, Rider Force? Today I'm making a, a complete Dragon Ball edited uh, VHS video that contains all, I believe it's 12 that exist. 14 if you're one of the guys that believe West City Chase and Unordered Hunt exist. I've all but confirmed that they do not exist, so I don't count them anymore. Now, if they somehow do exist, and it comes to find out that they do exist, I'm going to count them, of course. So, 12 if you're me, 14 if you're the whole, if you're everybody else that believe that they exist. I will show you uh, all of them regardless which way you believe or whatnot because I'm going to show the completed artwork regardless. So real quick, uh, I'm going to show you that and then we're going to get into the rest of this part two of this video which is I'm going to upload two videos of this. One that just shows the tapes and then one that goes into the history of me getting them all. So, Okay guys, so here we have the 12 edited Dragon Ball tapes. Uh, if you guys, if any, if you guys out there collect uh, Dragon Ball VHS's you guys know that the tournament the saga of Goku the tournament saga and the first two tapes of the Red Ribbon Army saga were not released in edited formats except for the saga of Goku it's technically edited but I keep it with my uncut set because it was released by Kidmark and they did not make an uncut version of that um, but yeah the tournament saga was only released uncut the saga of Goku was released in edited not by Funimation regardless of that this is where the Art, the spine arts start for the edited. Uh, the first two tapes of Red Ribbon Army, which were uh, The Hunt Is On and Silver, were not released in uh, edited format. They started the spine art with, in the edited, with Assault on Muscle Tower. Uh, it would be a three tape saga, but uh, West City Chase edited, I've all but confirmed, does not exist. So. Yeah, and then if you if you guys know the General Blue Saga, the first and last tape uh, were released in uncut format, but I've all but confirmed that Underwear to Hunt does not exist either. And as you guys know, the two middle tapes, which would have been Pirate's Cave and something else, uh, were not released. Uh, there's a stock photo of the Pirate's Cave online. There's actually a website that says it exists, but that one I can basically tell you 100% does not exist. Uh, you could argue that West City and Underwear to Hunt possibly exist but I've done some digging I'm gonna make a video on that basically confirming that it does not exist in edited format so I don't count them basically because I don't believe they exist if you believe they exist then count them I will show them anyways in this video after I cover this then I'm gonna cover all the possible uh, scenarios it could be uh, but yes so we got the two for the Red Ribbon Army Saga we got the one for General Blue which is Lost in Penguins Village uh, like I said the First one, I do not believe exists in edited format like the uncut counterparts, same as West City. Now we have the Commander Red Saga. We have Danger for Hire, Corrin's Tower, and the Mythical Battle is One. From this point on, the tapes from here all the way to here, they are mythical status. They are almost impossible to find. Uh, these two being the easiest, uh, and then these three, the next easiest. Uh, these are kind of medium to hard to find. These are just like super easy. Anybody can look them up now and probably find them. Uh, but from this point on, all the way to Tian Shin Han Tournament Day, they are what I call the seven mythical tapes or Dragon Balls because literally it just happens to be seven and there's seven Dragon Balls. So if you have these seven, you can summon Shinron, bro. Uh, anyways, Battle is won. Uh, then we have the... My newest addition to my collection, Five Warriors Edited, the first tape of the Fortune Teller Baba Saga. We have Yamsa's Fall, Surprise Reunion, um, Seventh Dragon Ball, Goku's Journey, ending off the Baba Saga, and then to probably the rarest tape ever, debatably. I got this one before I got Five Warriors, though, but anyways, this is Tian Shin Han Tournament Day. This tape, nobody knew existed. Uh, well, you cannot look it up and find out that it exists. There's a stock photo, but that doesn't prove anything because there's a stock photo. There's a stock photo of West City Chase and Underwater Hunt and the Pirates Cave, but those don't exist. But anyways, uh, yep. Yeah. There's Tian Shin Han Tournament Day. Super amazing. The the spine art for it is just so weird to me even to this day. Uh, but yes. And now for you guys that actually believe that West City Chase and Underwater Hunt exist. I went ahead and made custom tapes for myself, so um, 
I'm just going to show this because you know, a lot of people like to see completed artwork. And I made a custom tape of this. This is not real. Uh, and uh, no, I'm not making it for nobody. This is just for me because I don't want this getting out there and falsely, uh, you know, showing people that it exists when it doesn't. Uh, I also made a custom tape for On a Water Hunt edited. This is not real. This is a fake that I made. Uh, no, I'm not making it for nobody. Okay, so so this is what a completed set would look like if these two existed, right? Uh, now, I'm, I'm going to say this to my knowledge and all the research I've done, they do not exist. I'm not saying that there's a possibility they don't because there could be there could be a sample version of it that Funimation produced. They could be, heck, there could be a box. They, Funimation could have actually produced a box and they never made any more copies because the uncut counterparts were limited release too. Something went on, which I'm going to make a video. Something went on in production that made them cancel the uncut and edited tapes because on their website back in the day, uh, the uncut counterparts of these aren't even listed on their website. So something went on in the production of those two tapes that they had to cancel the uncut production and that's why the uncut versions are so hard to find as well. Uh, I'll go into more details on another video with that if you guys want to see that. I've done a lot of research in the years. Okay, and here is... Now, if you're really a freak and you believe that Pirate's Cave exists, well, I made that tape as well. Pirate's Cave would have been the second tape in the uh, General Blue Saga, so here it is. This is not real. I just made it for myself. So if you believe that the second tape existed... Uh, this would be what a completed set would look like. Uh, but 100% that doesn't exist. 99.9% .9 those don't exist. Okay. And now if you're a really a freak like me. And uh, you want to see what all the completed artwork looks like. Well, I got that for you as well. So I made this tape. This is I just named it the Pirate Robot. I made all custom tapes of tapes that were not released ever. And I made them. I'm an idiot. Excuse me. <laughs> Uh, I made all custom tapes for non-complete animation. And the only thing left now is uh, tension on end. Well, of course, I did that too. Uh, I'm not going to go into all the details of these custom tapes because I just... I did their own, my own design for the cover. I have a video of that as well that I will put up on the channel if you guys want to see. Um, uh, Tien Shinhan would have been a six tape uh, saga because I did the math and how Funimation did it. I figured out their formula. Uh, this would be what a completed artwork of the edited tapes would be if they finished releasing the Tien Shinhan saga. Now I did make a King Piccolo and Piccolo Jr. tapes just for myself. I don't feel the need to show those in this video because they didn't even they didn't even start those sagas at all. So I'm just completing what they would have released if they finished what they started. So this would technically be what a complete edited set would look like if they finished. And to me that looks bonkers. But yeah, so I I, I was able to make this video for all of you guys. People that believe these exist and that exists and people that wanted to just see all the artwork. So whatever you believe in, it's all here. Uh, like I said, I am uh, a fine believer in these not existing or that one. But, you know, whatever you want to believe is fine. That's fair. I have this video is for you. Uh, and that is the complete Dragon Ball edited collection. Uh, it's been a long journey. Thank you guys so much for watching and being part of this with me. I will continue to make videos and we're going to complete our complete media collection together. Uh, you guys subscribe, like, leave a comment below. You guys are the best. Peace out, guys.